Okay, everyone. Here is another radio that I have right now. This is, uh, I would consider this to be a pretty, this is a very rare, um, this is a very rare radio, to be honest with you. If I'm being honest with you, this is a pretty rare radio. Um, this is a uh, Craig Pocket Radio. You know, it's an AM FM radio with a digital display and alarm clock. You know, so obviously this is not this is no vintage radio at all. This is nothing. It's not even a twenty year old radio, as far as I'm aware. Like it's not even twenty years old yet. But I've had this radio since um, uh, and since I was about uh, ten or eleven years old. You know. So yeah, just this Craig Pocket Radio, and in fact, it is way smaller than this Radio Shack Pocket Radio. It is way smaller. Like, look at the size. Look at the size comparison right there. It is so much smaller. You know, like it, it'll really fit in your pocket, no problem. But uh, yeah. So obviously, like you get your speaker um, right there. You even have this this loop right here so if you like um, wanted to hold it like this I guess so you don't drop it or lose it yeah that's pretty neat in fact this even has an alarm clock believe it or not it even has an alarm clock um, and there's your volume and your tuning dials and even on the back of it so you just have your uh, just your battery cover. This time it takes um, triple A's, just two of them, I believe. So, yeah, it's just uh, it's a very small radio. And it's from 2009. So there's your manufacturing date there, and then you have some other um, other info on here. Just made in China, nothing too special, like, but. Um, it's obviously a way newer radio. You got your earphone jack right there. Now, obviously, it is not in the best of shape either. It's it's had quite a it's had quite a lot of use out of it. It's not in the best shape, but it does still work. You know, although. This bit was my fault here. I accidentally broke the antenna like that. The little bit of casing right there, but I had I was able to have that repaired so that the antenna can still go up and down like this. Pretty interesting. And uh it's not one that goes very high, I guess. It's not one that goes all too high or anything, but it's it it, it 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 works just fine, you know. But yeah, it's it. This thing does still work, yeah. And it's a bit of a, it's kind of a quirky way. It's it's a pretty quirky way to do it. So obviously there's your power off, but the only actual way to try and turn this radio on is if you press the AM or FM button. That because it's it says power on right there. It's kind of, it's a pretty weird way, so let's, um, try and do it as, um, let's try and put it to AM right now. And admittedly, yeah, this is a very, very finicky radio too, actually. Like if you have it where it's not just it's it's not just in the right orientation depending on the station. It's just not you're not gonna get good reception. You know? You know? Like you can even have like something like a like a building block and that's just not gonna work well. You know. And um one more thing too, that's also a bit of a pain with this radio, is trying to tune it to the right channel. It is this um, this dial is way too sensitive, like, you can try and 
set it. You have to be very, very slow and careful with this, you know, to try and get it just right because it barely takes anything. See what I mean? I'm trying to get it to 800 here. Just the smallest of movements. Even just letting off of the dial. I hit 800. I'm just going to let off of it right now. And, um, you know, just... Here, let's try this again. Some, it is just such a finicky one. Oh yeah, there it goes. 801 now. It, yeah, it is so, this, uh, this tuning dial is really, really sensitive, honestly. It's more sensitive than, uh, than sodium in the water. Yeah, it's very finicky, though. But, yeah. It's a very finicky dial, you know. Oh, one more thing, too. Remember how I said it has a digital... Remember how I said it has a digital display with an alarm and a clock? It's right there. So, so like, turn this, turn this off, and then time set. I can just choose. I can just go with the hours and minutes here. So it's like that. Even the alarm as well. Turn it on and off, and even set it too. You know, it's pretty much just like any other alarm clock, really. It's just like a basic alarm clock, so. Yeah, I find it still pretty cool. It's it's fairly rare, because I haven't seen much about... I have not seen these very much on the internet at all. So, yeah. Anyways, I'm going to end this video quick, because I'm running out of storage on my phone. Might as well have to upload videos and clear it all. But, um, anyways, thank you for watching this. Well, I hope you have anyway. Hope you have enjoyed watching it. Um, see you fellas later. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.